The trends that are being seen now this year is very much in relation to millennials. They make a decision on organisations to join based a lot on their CSR, so what these organisations are giving back to communities. But also organisations now have to adapt their culture for employees coming from overseas. They have to understand that if they're not coming from Ireland or Europe, they will have a culture fit that they have to address and they have to adapt to these employees as well coming in. And as always, in relation to trends and changes, brand is huge. Employees and potential candidates are always, they, they do a lot of more research than they did previously in joining an organisation. Human resource directors are adapting to these trends through mentorship programmes to allow employees to grow successfully within their organisation and make sure they're successful in promotion and have promotional opportunities. But they're also adapting with advances in technology to allow employees to work from home, flexible working hours, but also still be connected to their team, but may not have to be in the office at any given time. So you could have three or four team members working from home, but still connected to each other. Senior resource directors leave organisations through various reasons. However, the top three that I'm seeing when I interview candidates are natural churn. They want to progress their own career, so you'll get maybe circa two to three years out of them. Lack of vision from top down. So they're, they're not being, they, they don't share the same vision that's there, but also they have no influence at the strategy. And the HR function is vital with any organization, and if there's no influence over strategy, that's when people will move on. There's a few things you can do to retain employees and identify issues. Um, if an employee is feeling that they're not being recognised for work they're put in, you can put in an award structure as well. In relation to retaining them, make sure that they feel included and engaged. Their well-being is utmost and that brings back to the fact of EAS system. But also, as well as that, bonus payments as well, be it every three or six months, um, for recognition of work put in.